Fuck. All right, we begin today with something that could have a big impact on your wallet. Yes, now I know I got your attention and you're listening. A cyber attack on a major fuel pipeline is raising concerns that gas prices and supplies could be impacted here in South Carolina. The Colonial Pipeline transports gasoline and other fuel through 10 states between Texas and New Jersey, and it delivers 45% of the fuel consumed on the East Coast. So that's everything from gasoline to heating oil and jet fuel. We have team coverage of the story tonight. We begin with Kaylin Hagwood with the details on how the pipeline attack could impact us right here in South Carolina. Well, Darcy, we're already starting to see some of the local impact with gas stations like the Corner Pantry here in Sumter posting signs limiting the amount of gas you can buy. I spoke to a petroleum analyst with Gas Buddy who says over the next week, gas prices could increase by 5 to 15 cents due to the pipeline issue, but their main concern is supply. With the Colonial Pipeline down, there are smaller gas suppliers, but this is a major hit for an industry already facing delivery challenges due to COVID-19 urge to conserve, not to go out and hoard gasoline. That will turn this into much more of a major pricing and supply disruption event. Um, obviously, with the pipeline still down, uh, we remain kind of in limbo to see uh, or hear when the pipeline may be restarted. So a pretty significant challenge developing. But again, I urge motorists not to rush out and fill their tanks in response. That will make things much worse. Well, analysts say if motorists are to hoard that gas, it could make the issue much, much more challenging whenever uh, the pipeline is back online. It can make it more difficult for the system to bounce back. Reporting live here in Sumter, I'm Kaylin Hagwood. Darcy? Kaylin, thank you so much. Our